So in case you didn't know, the cabins at Fort Wilderness Resort at Disney World have been under construction for some time and are opening very soon, as of today, I believe, um, to become DVC villas. We got some concept art and some renderings in the past few months, but today was the first day we were actually able to look inside the villas and I got a first look and I want to take you along with me. So let's go check it out. All right, we're getting a first look at the new DVC cabins, villas, cabins at Fort Wilderness. All right, so here is a first look at the living and kitchen space of the brand new uh, DVC cabins at Fort Wilderness. This is the kitchen area and the table right there. If you have seen the older cabins, this is a major upgrade and you may be thinking that this is no longer that rustic experience you were used to. And I'm currently staying here at Fort Wilderness at one of the, uh, I guess, last remaining cabins. And yeah, you do lose that rustic feel, but this is great. You got a full range oven here, stove top, check this out. Hidden Mickey. I think so. You've got a large microwave, brand new appliances, dishwasher, large sink, window above the sink for a nice view. Right there, that's another one of the new units. A big um, coffee maker spaced out there. And you can make an individual cup or you can make a large pot. There's your Joffrey's even in K-cup form. Let's move on over here. Now, what I like about this is the space. They opened up and raised the ceilings, I think, on these newer buildings. And you can see a lot of the natural light coming in. And these are really tenant and privacy type windows. There's a thermostat for this space, but the you also have the options for the curtains right here. But yeah, it looks really good. Check that out. And this is a pull down bed. I was told that this is a reference to an older Mickey cartoon. So that's a nice touch, but with an upgraded look, you can pull down the bed. It's a, it's a fold out bed in the, in the older units. So I think that's a really nice modern touch. Brand new large screen TVs. Good to see now. Let's go into the bedroom. All right, going into the bedroom here, you will notice also a lot of modern touches up here is the bunk bed. Now, I'm currently staying in one of the units and I'm a dad. So what am I thinking about immediately? These gaps are larger than in the uh, existing bed frames. So if you have young kids like I do, this may be more of a concern because right now um, we're not as concerned because there's less of a gap for the kids to fall out. You get some rustic, nice artwork up here. You got a little owl right there, some birds. If you look really closely, let me see. Right there, you see the number 17 next to sleeping uh, Chip or Dale, November 19th. That's the day that this, that the original Fort Wilderness opened. Just a fun fact that I recently learned. You've got Donald's feet right here by the lower bunk. Got Chip laying right there. You got some storage units down here. Really spacious, really comfortable, nice accommodations. Hey Disney, of course, please don't turn on. But yeah, these colors, if you'll notice, are nods to different characters. Donald, Mickey, Goofy, or Pluto, and Minnie. Isn't that cool? I was just told about those references. Nice, big, comfortable bed. Over here, there is more space. This is nifty, a nifty nook. The current cabins, the bed is all the way over here. So there's no space. So you have your own little space and area to put your phone and your things. And look at these charging types, USB-C, USB, and your standard outlet. More artwork, rustic in nature, but definitely more modern looking. Another window over here and some great storage options right there. Fantastic. I am really impressed seeing these in person. This is the first day that you could look at them to tour the DVC villas. 
they're all going to be DVC villa, convert to DVC villas, I was told. And I think this is, this is a major upgrade. Again, I know you're missing some of the rustic touches and some of that Fort Wilderness feel that I'm just becoming acquainted with, but I think this is a huge step up. So yeah, this is the bedroom, lots of space, lots of touches. Oh, and your own thermostat for keeping the temperature at your liking. Back in the main open area over here, again, much larger feeling. I think it's the same footprint, but it just feels better. Okay, so these are kind of flipped. So in the current cabins, this is towards the living room and they flipped it so that this is now the bathroom and there's this outdoor space right here. Not outdoor, but outside of the bathroom space with extra storage, just a sink area, a vanity, more art over here. Chippendale doing archery, which is an activity you can do here at this resort. And here is the bathroom. Really big, lots of natural light, a lot of privacy in here. These modern touchings make it, make it just feel more thought out, more spacious. And the older ones are really great, but they do feel a little cramped in comparison. I feel like I can really compare them to because I'm currently staying in one of the older ones. One of the new Disney touches there, having your shampoo, conditioner, and body wash in bottles. I will say there is no tub here. I like that it's a low entry for safety, but there's no tub. If you have small kids like I do, that's something you want to note since we normally prefer a bath, but I think the kids would still be able to use that, of course. There's an added window in here, lots of natural space, this nice light, big sink. Just a really good use of the space. And like, like I said, I think I, I'm really impressed by these. I wasn't sure what to expect, but this is, this is nice. All right, that's the full tour. I can show you the outdoor area soon, but that is the new DVC Lastly, Villas. the new patio Wilderness. furniture is a step up from the current picnic tables at the cabins. To be specific, and they DVC include cabins. this fun Mickey detail here on the chairs. Let me know what you think about the new DVC cabins at Fort Wilderness.